Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about blood pressure. So we know in our community that we see tons of people with high blood pressure. So how do doctors measure blood pressure? So each time the heart beats, it sends blood rushing through the arteries. Um, the peak reading of the pressure is the systolic pressure. So when that blood starts going through the veins, the highest peak of pressure, that is going to be that top number that your doctor gives you as it relates to blood pressure. So between the beats, the heart begins to relax and the blood pressure drops. And then the lowest point is the diastolic pressure. Um... 95% of all high blood pressure is related to lifestyle and dietary factors. Another word we hear um, for blood pressure is hypertension. And so I'll be using those words interchangeably um, throughout this video. So what are some dietary um, factors and lifestyle factors that cause high blood pressure or hypertension? Stress. Lack of exercise, smoking, obesity, high sodium, low fiber, high sugar diets. Um, symptoms of um, hypertension problems or high blood pressure problems um, is simply, a lot of times there won't be any symptoms. Um, but severe high blood pressure can lead to headaches, confusion, nausea, and vomiting. So... My recommendations. My recommendations here are very simple. I'm going to tell you that you should choose um, frozen vegetables over canned vegetables because frozen vegetables don't have as much sodium um, within them. If you get a canned vegetable, what I would have you do is to go ahead and like when you open that can, rinse all that extra sodium off and place um, whatever canned goods you have in water and then that should reduce the sodium about 50%. Um, any other recommendations? Oh yeah, avoid table salt altogether. One tip I have for this is just remove your um, salt shakers off of your dinner table or out of your bedroom, wherever you keep you know, your salt shaker. That way, whatever salt is that is not added during cooking won't be added to the plate. Um, work with the nutrition coach to come up with a regimen full of dietary fiber, calcium, magnesium, and eat liberally foods like celery, garlic, onions, nuts, and seeds. Also, don't forget um, your vitamin C foods like broccoli and your citrus fruits like oranges. Okay, so until next time, don't forget to read your food labels. I hope this helps you with any blood pressure problems that you might be having, or it helps you love someone to life um, around you who is having blood pressure problems. Like this video if you found this information helpful, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.